Hey there, another week, another video. Today we'll be putting up against each other the top 12 best MMORPG games in 2020. Hi, this is Roblox Olympics, and the game is on. But before we head straight into the video, I would need you to answer this question. What's the top rated MMORPG of all time? The answer is hidden somewhere in this video. The correct answer will have a shout out from us, of course, on the next video. All right, let's get started. World Zero. World Zero is one of the best MMORPG games. Honestly, it was like created last year. It was fully released this year though. You can choose between three classes here, the Swordsmaster, Mage, or Defender. There are also various tiers for each class, like Dual Wielder, which is Tier 1, Paladin, Tier 2, Elementalist, Tier 1, Mage of Light, Tier 2, Guardian, Tier 1, and Berserker, Tier 2. Right now, Demon is the most powerful class. Each of these classes has their own unique abilities, combos, and visual effects. Midnight from Remnant Midnight from Remnant is the most new free roam RPG in town. It has a unique type of magic ability called Semblance that you can bind into your weapon. There are three species or races in this game, the Human, the Cat Faunus, and the Rabbit Faunus. The customizations are pretty good. Some of these locations are currently locked behind a level requirement and you actually need to grind here to level up, just like any MMORPG really. For the kind of skills, I think the game has its own unique charm. For the introduction of Semblance, there are really unique mechanics for a game. World of Magic World of Magic is a 2020 free-to-play Roblox MMORPG game. Explore the continents of Magius and hone your magic, battle others, join a guild, be a hero, or become a dark wizard. Pretty much like Harry Potter MMO, but better. This game includes five magic categories, divided into specific magic divisions. There are also armors, weapons, and consumables. One of the most unique features of this game is the culture that exists within the game. There's also a reputation system that you can level up and pretty much get the perks of being a reputable person. Anomic Anomic is like State of Anarchy, but it is situated in the 90s, if you ever play that game. The game is not just a survival game but a role-playing game too. And since we're talking about RPGs, there are classes here like being a driver, paramedic, SWAT, civvies, and many more. Beyblade Rebirth. Beyblade Rebirth is a free roam RPG game. Yep, yep, it's all about Beyblades. Very unorthodox for a Roblox game. You're a blader in this game who wanted to become the strongest Beyblader. Some of the features of this game includes typical RPG elements like quests, stat systems, and skills, except Beyblades have special moves and the likes. Shinobi Life 2 If we're talking about the best MMORPGs out there, of course Shinobi Life 2 will be here. This is a Naruto RPG game, the reworked version of the original Shinobi Life. The game features a free roam mode to explore many worlds in A-Zones. You'll be able to visit canon villages and you'll be able to use various jutsus and subjutsus, all in the form of Keki Genkai. There's a lot here to mention, so I'll keep it short. Just play the damn game and you'll drop more than enough hours for you to miss out on your school and work. Avatar The Legend of Korra Beta An RPG game based on the show Avatar The Legend of Korra and The Last Airbender is Beta Avatar The Legend of Korra. It's your best game for anything related to the Avatar series. You'll be able to bend elements here and have the most fun experience, except for like in the Korra series. Deadly Sins Retribution Based on the anime counterpart, Deadly Sins Retribution is a game where you can learn magic, fight enemies, and master your sins. There are various races here that you can choose from, and the game is pretty much enjoyable, especially if you're familiar with the series. Sword Burst 2 Boy, oh boy. All the Kirito fakes here played this game. Sword Burst 2 is a multiplayer RPG game inspired by Sword Art Online. In this game, you'll be able to explore the vast world, defeat enemies, and collect rare gear to defeat bosses, which can be unlocking the next floors, as there are 11 of them in this game, alongside your friends. The Wild West The Wild West is a game inspired by Red Dead Redemption 2. It's a free roam game with pretty much the same aesthetic as any cowboy role-playing MMO. It's a pretty game that has detailed takes on the locations, which changes the lighting system for each period. A pretty neat touch. Dragon's Life Dragon's Life is a free roam role playing game with dragons as the name suggests. You can play as a dragon, which ranges from an adult, teen, child, or even an egg. Yes, you can play as an egg in this game. The elements you choose act as your powers, and of course you can fly. It also has good animations on being a dragon, like sitting, sleeping, laying, roaring, and many more. It's a pretty weird game since there is a school and adoption center. Like, what the hell, man? Welcome to Hexaria. Hexaria. 
Welcome to Hexaria, a free roam MMORPG card game. This game is one of the most unique aspects in MMORPGs as you can use your cards in a 3D grid environment, battle with your friends and enemies. It's not really hard to play and it's pretty fun. The game features card gaming, gold and hexons as currencies, a polished questing system, and bosses. It's a card game, but it's better. One of the cool aspects of this game is that you can join ongoing card game battles to help anyone who are struggling with the NPCs or other players. Alright, that's it for now. I hope you guys enjoy these games. Oh, and don't forget to tick the notification bell once you're subscribed here on the channel. Hit like and comment if you enjoy our content. Until next time, Roblox Olympics, out!